there's no one-size-fits-all approach to buying a laptop for programming, and making the right choice can be a tough process. You can write code on most laptops, but how do you find a laptop for programming that will greatly improve your productivity? In this video, we break down the top 5 laptops for programming on the market this year, based on price versus performance, and situations they'll be used in. We'll be taking a look at products in every budget range, so regardless of whether you've got a few bucks to spare and want the best value, or you're looking for the best of the best, we'll have an option for you. So if you're interested in finding out which laptop for programming will be best for you, stay tuned. All the links to find the best prices on all the products mentioned in this video will be in the description below. The products mentioned in this video are in no exact order, so be sure to stay tuned till the end so you don't miss anything. We'll start with the HP Spectre X360, our choice for best value laptop for programming. If you're a programmer looking for a relatively affordable laptop, the HP Spectre X360 retails for around $850, and its powered-up CPU and onboard memory make a great laptop for programming that doesn't break the bank. The 13.3-inch 1920x1080 FHD IPS touchscreen uses Brightview technology for superior color, and the island-style keyboard is softly backlit in white with nice large keys that are a pleasure to use, and the trackpad has a wide touch area and satisfyingly firm click. Processing power is important, especially when you're compiling code. The Spectre X360 has an Intel i5-1035 G4 processor with clock speeds from 1.1GHz up to 3.7GHz, and a 6MB cache. Graphics are handled by the Intel Iris Plus GPU, and 8GB of onboard memory will give you lots of stability, even when you have a lot of operations going. And for speedy app and data storage, there's a 256GB SSD. The True Vision HD webcam uses an IR camera array for the Windows Hello function and lets you log in using facial recognition. There's also a fingerprint scanner just below the keyboard as an alternative login method. The X360 also comes with the HP Pen, a stylus-like tool that you can use to select or erase text, or you can also configure the two buttons on the pen to execute other tasks. Connectivity options include two Thunderbolt 3-enabled USB-C ports and a single USB-A port. There's also a headphone jack and a micro SD card reader. For speedy networking, the Spectre X360 gives you Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5. Battery life is impressive, with the 4-cell 60-watt-hour lithium-ion polymer battery giving you around 12.5 hours per charge. The HP Spectre X360 has the processing power and onboard memory that creates a reliable environment for all your coding projects, and its wallet-friendly price tag makes it a great option that will keep you within a reasonable price range. Next, we'll take a look at the Dell XPS 15, our choice for best overall laptop for programming. The Dell XPS 15 is priced at around $1,700, and it has enough beefy processing power to tackle your programming needs, along with a backlit keyboard with 1.5mm of travel that's easy to type on, making it one of the best overall laptop choices for programming. Its 15.6-inch FHD Plus edge-to-edge -edge display is equipped with Display HDR400, Dolby Vision, and has incredibly small bezels, so practically all you see is screen, and that adds even more beauty to an already beautiful laptop. The keyboard is super comfortable to use with good travel, and the keycaps are about 9.7% larger, promoting greater typing speed and accuracy, which is great for adding modifying lines and lines of code. The glass touchpad has also grown, and is as smooth and easy to click as ever. Next to the keyboard on either side, you'll find two upward-facing speaker grills that house a quad speaker arrangement that sound pretty good. Under the hood, the XPS 15 has an Intel Core i7-10750H with a 5GHz clock speed, an NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1650 Ti GPU with a 4GB cache, 16GB DDR4 internal storage, and a 512GB solid-state drive to store all your data and apps. To connect up external peripherals, you get three Thunderbolt 3 ports, an SD card reader, and a headphone jack. And to keep you coding all day long, the XPS 15 comes with an 86-watt-hour lithium-ion battery that will give you about 12 hours of uptime between charges. For networking, there's a built-in killer Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.0. If you're shopping for a laptop for your programming projects, the Dell XPS 15 is one of the best you'll find. The XPS 15 hits the mark on all the important points, including a keyboard with great feel, beefy processing power, and enough onboard RAM to let you easily multitask and compile without issues. Now we have the MacBook Air, our choice for best laptop for programming under $1,000. Apple's M1 chip gives the MacBook Air faster CPU and GPU speeds faster machine learning with its advanced neural engine, and amazing battery life that makes it one of the best laptops under $1,000 and a great choice for programming students on the go. The MacBook Air is sleek and stylish and sports a 13.3-inch 2560x1600 IPS Retina display with a large color space for vibrant images and incredible detail that maxes out at 400 nits of brightness. If you spend a lot of time coding, Apple's revised Scissor Switch keyboard and massive trackpad will serve you well. Each key has a rubber dome and scissor switch that make for a bouncier typing experience with more key travel and overall a more comfortable feel. The MacBook Air runs silently. There's no fan, just an aluminum heat spreader. Even when pushing the MacBook Air to its limits, it stays cool. The processor, GPU, and neural engine all reside on the M1 chip, as referred to as the System On chip, and is made up of an 8-core CPU with 4 performance cores and 4 efficiency cores, an 8-core GPU, and a 16-core neural engine, which accelerates the performance of the CPU, GPU, and machine learning tasks at a speed of about 11 trillion operations per second, and will keep your compiling and other intense operations fast and fluid. 
For storage, a super fast 256 gigabyte SSD launches your apps and opens and writes your files in an instant. For battery life, you can expect to get about 15 hours of uptime, which will easily see you through the entire day. For wireless connectivity, the MacBook Air uses Wi-Fi 6 networking and Bluetooth 5.0, so you'll enjoy speedy, future-proof networking. If you're a programmer or a programming student, the MacBook Air is perfectly capable of handling resource-intensive tasks and is a top choice at the sub-$1,000 price point. If you're interested in updated pricing on any of the items mentioned in this video, be sure to check out the links below. Prices update on these products almost daily with sales and general price drop, so if you want to find the most updated information, check the description. If you find this video helpful, please help out the channel by giving this video a like and tell us which product caught your eye in the comments below. This brings us to the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Extreme Laptop, our choice for great all-rounder laptop for programming. The $1,300 Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Extreme is a powerful laptop that handles simultaneous demanding tasks with ease. The ThinkPad X1 Extreme's 15.6-inch 1920x1080 IPS display puts out 300 nits of brightness, and when it comes to keyboards, you'd be hard-pressed to find a better laptop keyboard than high-end ThinkPads. The layout puts home and end keys on the top row, and page up and page down at the lower right by the cursor arrows, and two levels of backlighting are available. The typing feel is quiet but snappy, with firm tactile feedback. Pointing device fans can choose between the mid-size touchpad and the TrackPoint mini joystick embedded in the keyboard with three mouse buttons located below the spacebar. Both work smoothly and accurately. A 720p webcam captures bright and colorful images without noise or static, though they are a bit soft on focus. Bottom firing speakers produce adequate sound, short on bass, but with clear highs and mid-tones. Dolby software lets you tinker with music, movie, game, voice, and dynamic presets. For computing power, the X1 Extreme uses an Intel i5-10400H processor with clock speeds ranging from 2.6GHz up to 4.6GHz. Graphics are processed by an NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1650Ti GPU, and 8GB of RAM helps the processor tackle multiple tasks at once, and all of your files and apps can be stored on a 256GB SSD. Connectivity options give you two USB 3.2 ports, two Thunderbolt 3 ports, an HDMI port, audio jack, and an SD card slot. And for wireless networking, there's Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.1. To keep you powered up, the X1 Extreme has an internal 80 watt hour 4 cell lithium polymer battery that will give you about 14 hours of uptime between charges. If you're a programmer, the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Extreme is a great all rounder that brings you the best in every department comfortable keyboarding, a powerful CPU and GPU, and enough RAM to keep all your running tasks fast and uninterrupted. Last, we'll be looking at the Apple MacBook Pro 16 inch, our choice for best programming laptop for Mac users. If you want one of the most powerful laptops for programming, the $2,200 Apple MacBook Pro 16-inch is well worth the investment. This new MacBook Pro is the most powerful Apple laptop yet, and whether you're a programmer, filmmaker, podcaster, graphic designer, or a writer, you'll see the improvements in your productivity because of its speed, memory, and capabilities. Its 16-inch Retina display with True Tone technology produces dazzling highlights, bright whites, and deep blacks with peak brightness of 500 nits at a resolution of 3072 by 1920, and the P3 wide color gamut provides good color accuracy and supports millions of colors. The Magic Keyboard has a soft feel that resists fatigue and uses a scissor mechanism with new keycap design that's more concave, and has a rubber dome underneath each key for better stability and comfort. For computing power, the MacBook Pro uses an Intel i7 processor running at 2.66 GHz with turbo boost up to 4.5 GHz and has a 12 MB cache. The GPU is made up of both an AMD Radeon Pro 5300M with 4 GB of memory on board and integrated UHD Graphics 630 with automatic graphics switching. 16 GB of RAM gives you plenty of memory to work with and a 512 GB SSD is installed for all your files. To connect your peripherals, the MacBook Pro gives you 4 Thunderbolt 3 ports and a USB 3.1 port. For wireless networking, there's Wi-Fi and Bluetooth 5.0, and the MacBook Pro has the highest capacity battery Apple has ever put into a laptop. The 100 watt hour lithium polymer battery delivers up to 11 hours of sustained power, so you'll be able to get more work done between charges. If you're a programmer, especially if you're developing iOS or macOS apps, the Apple MacBook Pro is a no-brainer, and well worth the higher price tag. It has plenty of computing power, a comfortable keyboard, and enough battery power to get you through the day. Alright guys, that's all for now. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like. If you're new to the channel and you like the video, consider subscribing. We do our best to keep you up to date with the best products on the market right now, so if you want to stay current regarding the best gear, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Be sure to check out the description for links to find the most up-to-date pricing on all the products mentioned in this video. Hope you all have a great day, and we'll see you back here soon for the next video.